Welcome back guys, welcome to another episode of City Skylines. My name is Sports Monkey, and for today, welcome back to Fox Valley. For today, I wanted to go in and we need to build more transportation in our City Skylines Sunset Harbor DLC map. I would like to create more transportation. Uh, specifically, I would like to create the Metro. So today's video is how to build the Metro in your city uh, you will need the city skylines mass transit and the city skyline sunset harbor dlc's in order to create both of these uh, cr to create everything that we're going to build today so what i'm going to start off at we are looking at our oil our oil industry by the way but what we're going to start out we're going to go back to our city center and what i really would like to build today is i would like to create what's called the train metro hub so the goal of the train metro hub from the sunset harbor dlc uh this is really brand new uh this this hub and what it does is it connects the train lines which we have a train li line to our right connects the train lines and metro lines to our city so i'm gonna actually have to delete some of this road so we can insert it into our city so let's go back and let's click a now the real question is right now what side is which now i believe the more covered side that we're looking at is is the train line and i will t be able to take a i will be able to know what it is in a matter of a couple seconds so give me let me reconnect this all right let's see here i believe this is the train line so let's go to our train tracks and we're gonna connect this up immediately. So remember, this is the train metro hub, which it connects, hold on, let's see. Beautiful, and I was correct. That works perfect. So what this hub does is it's fantastic. It, it takes trains from the outside and connects it to our metro. Now, th to this left-hand side is our metro. Now, the thing is, is we don't have any metro we don't have any metro stations around, but what I want to do is first get this back to underground. There, where you belong. The metro belongs underground. I think we all know that. So, now that we need to create some metro stations. So, what we're going to do is I need to create them in our... I want to create them in our city center, which is right where we're at, and in the suburbs. So, what you have to do is when you're in... The transportation you're going over to metro and we're going to create you're going to click a and you're going to and we're going to insert now some of these metro stations create noise pollution as you can tell in as you can tell in front of you there is an orange circle this orange circle is the noise pollution it gives off now we are now right where we're at is all commercial so the commercial industry should not have an issue with it and then we're gonna put one right here again this is this should be commercial on both sides which that's how I planned it when I built the city I'm also gonna put a metro right here between our lovely train station and bus hub then I'm gonna go into our suburbs so I think we need to put one in our industrial area even though it's not the best industrial area or it's not the most it's not the busiest industrial area in the world but you know, uh, it, it does the job. Now, this is going to be a little tricky because I'm inserting, I'm inserting, I'm building the metro stations in neighborhoods. Now, this, now people are most likely going to complain about noise complaint or noise pollution. So I'm just warning you that right now we might have to make some adjustments as they start complaining, which you know that is definitely going to happen. So let's get back to our city center. And add more. Oh, slope is too steep. Oh, slope too steep. Anyways, we're just gonna keep adding these stations. I I think we're I think we'll just add one more. Oh, slope is too steep. Can't. Okay. Well, since it's that close, no, I'm just gonna leave it. I'm gonna leave it. So what we need to do next is connect all these lines. So where is our first? Where is our first station? It's right there. Okay. So we are already underground. Now, one of the issues we might have is that our 
train is actually... Oh, and we went underneath the train. Perfect. I was going to say, our cargo train station might have been in the way, but that's... That's okay. Now let's connect this. Good. So, as you can tell, we just connected our first metro train station. So, let's keep going. Now, where's our next one? It's right there. Now, that is connected perfectly. Now, I kind of want to do two different loops. I'm going to have one that goes to this loops around to the station over there. So, we can have like a city center loop, if that makes sense. And then we'll have a loop that goes out to... A loop that goes out to the suburbs, obviously. And that did not work out as planned. We need to lower it, that's why. Now we're going under we just went underneath the cargo line, which is fine. Oh, and there is. Now remember, all these lines are underground, so. It will be okay if it does look a little sloppy. It honestly won't really affect anything because guess what? It's underground, so don't really worry about it. Um, you know, aesthetically speaking, it won't be too bad because it's underground. So let's connect this line up. Oh, and I forgot where... There we go. So we connected the metro line now, but, but we only did the... Oh, and I did not mean to press A and do that. Oops. Sorry guys, while I'm doing this guys, can you please remember to like, subscribe, and comment? That'd be greatly appreciated. Everybody with my new video, um, the oil industry tutorial, you guys have been fantastic with that video and everything, you know, you guys have been, we've, we've added a lot of viewers, we've added a lot of subscribers, you guys have been really awesome and I do appreciate it. Now, one issue, uh, so please make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Like I said, greatly, greatly, greatly appreciated. You guys are awesome. And, you know, a lot of people don't know everything about City Skylines. I'm still, you know, I feel like I've played this game for years, and I'm still learning it. And, you know, it's just it's a learning process for everybody. But for there's a lot of newer people that have, have, have learned a lot from, uh, I've had a lot of PS4 users comment. Uh, DM me on um, Instagram and stuff like that just saying thank you for helping so you know I know some of the tutorials are you know if you're if you know what you're doing in this game you know you might not need to watch them but you know what I appreciate the support anyways so that's my little spiel about that so now we have all of our metro lines connected to each other so let's start it this is going to be our main hub area for that's going to be our main hub that we want everything to start. So we're just adding lines. So we're adding all of the lines, all of the uh, metro lines. Now we do want. Now we did want one metro line that went that went basically in our city, which we're doing perfectly. Look at that! Boom. All right. So now I think I'm gonna. I think I'm gonna try to get um, the line going the other way i'm going to add the suburbs so this will go there this will go there then we're going to add in the suburbs over here so the couple lines over here actually i think i do need to add one going both ways because people we don't need people waiting forever just to try to get to just to try to get to their destination so i'm going to add another line going the same direction we originally put. Oh, and I did not connect that one by accident. Oh, that's all right. All right, so we have that one. Now we're going to, like I said to you before, we're going to add a third line, which will just go into the suburbs. So we'll just have it go straight into the suburbs. So we'll have it go over here. This one's just going to be straight suburbs. And there. And there. And we added... It's to the industrial section, so don't worry about that. And by the way, if you look at how much money we're making, um, we are at $100,000 plus. So anybody who's ever questioned, you know, my methods, I've, I mean, nobody's really questioning it, but it, this, the way I've built cities works out awesome. So, uh, why didn't that, what the heck just happened? Um, 
Um, City Skylines. That should have rounded it out. I started it there. Alright, let's do that again. I don't know why City Skylines did that. But, um, yeah, as you can tell that we are making around $100,000 a day. Obviously, I don't have a ton of monuments yet, so don't, don't freak out, uh, those monuments. Oh, complete line? That was weird. Okay, anyways, I guess I completed that line. Um, so let's, um, as you can tell, we are adding a ton of money. We have lots of residential to, uh, that I have to get to. But as you can tell, the way I, you know, I'm not, all my little tips and tricks have worked out really well. And, you know, it's all, the proof is in the pudding. I have $2 million. I'm making $90,000 a day. And remember, before I go back to the Metro line, remember we were negative, oh, that's mining. Remember we were negative $9,000 before our oil industry kicked, finally kicked in. We're making $50,000. Look at that. And then... See this petroleum oil refinery? We are putting in $3,000 worth of materials and we're making about $10,000, which that is perfect. So now let's go back to this metro line, sorry. So as you can tell, we have people, zero people were on it so far, and um, which is okay because it just started. But um, what I wanna actually do is I'm gonna add a, a train line which I didn't think I could do but remember I have another train station so what I'm actually gonna do is connect this train line from here to here that's all it's gonna do is go back and forth so another option for our city for pe for citizens to actually get um, you know to get from place to place so that is the little tutorial the last thing I want to do is just add in a little bit of our we do have a lot of of residential demand so i want to fill that in a little bit and just do that right now now i'm not sh this should be okay now if there is noise complaints or noise issues i could put offices right along here which i might do anyways but i'll show you exactly what i'm gonna do Just to, just to fill in this this train metro hub area with people and that perfect. All right, so we're gonna we're gonna fill this in now. I do want a few offices over here, so our residents, if we do create, if we, I am gonna create residential nearby here, but I just wanted the offices to take all the noise pollution and. Not the residents, basically. There's that, so let's just even that up. Ish. That's pretty even. If I don't... Like, I know some, some of them have a couple more squares, but that's okay. So now let's add some high-density commercial to this area. And I do want to add bus lines to this area also, so I didn't forget about those. Don't, don't worry about that. Yes, my painting tool, I, I definitely screwed up a little bit right there, but that's all right. And I think, I think this Metro train hub is in a perfect area, honestly. I don't, there's no, ooh, get that one, one square. And get that one square. I think it's honestly in a perfect area, so I'm really happy where we placed it. There's that, and then we're gonna, oh, and it's saving. Now, when you're using these hubs, make sure you fo fully utilize them. Like like I said, the one we just added today was only the train and metro, but there are others where you can add like three or four different, like wait until we get to the metropolitan hub. There's three different ways of transportation to actually get to that um, metropolitan airport. So, you know, just be on the lookout for that. There's a lot more we can do, so I'm very interested in that. Um, we are not even close to building an airport. We're only at 36,000 people, but we're, we're getting there slowly but surely. And I know I have everything unlocked, so um, but I tr I do want to keep it um, somewhat realistic. All right, so that's perfect. So let's let's just take a peek, and we have 399 people using our. Train Metro Hub, so um, that's really cool. 
And as you can tell, this is what the metro looks like when it is above ground. So that's pretty neat. You don't see that every day. And then let's just see how many pe how many people are taking this train and slash train station. So that's 171. So not too bad. So like I said, this isn't in a perfect spot. And it's kind of in the middle of our city. We are eventually going to expand our city center to back here, which will be really cool. And too bad I couldn't get some of that water that's over there into here. That would have been nice. But, you know, I, again, I'm on the Xbox One console, so I really can't do much. But, um, you know, thank you guys for watching. I, I definitely appreciate it. And